A painful uphill. Man, I hate it. Adil, he just told us that there is a new road between Morocco and Mauretan, Mauritania. So basically, we do not have to take the boat. And uh, as far as I'm concerned, that's a great news. He said it's uh, nearly built, 95%. He also showed me a video and maybe we can take that road he said 1500 kilometers of the four lanes and about 600 kilometers more of uh, six lanes that's what he said and we will see how it goes otherwise he said that the road is good enough from morocco to mauritania and then good enough uh, till senegal the place is Martique and uh, if you're wondering about my eye it is not getting better we are following the road D5 and I must tell you it smells so good here my name is Matthew okay I love this guy <laughs> A I love this guy, <laughs> crazy <laughs> guy, Matthew. He's a freaking crazy guy too, and um, and he do is just a f problem. <laughs> Matthew, where are we? We are with, we are in Paradis. We are in France, in south south France. We have uh, just around Arles, several me, and uh, we have to this way just Marseille. And this guy, uh, he came from Slovenia and he go to Spain. And you go to Africa. Spain is that way. <laughs> we came from that way. <laughs> yeah. And uh, but now he come to here for just because you know the electricity. <laughs> of course, okay. we drain our battery. Or we are pushing, pushing, and, uh, pushing. And I, and I hope in your in your in your travel, you you look a lot of guys uh, with me. Yeah. Well, say it again. Say it again, Matt. Yeah. Yes. A lot of, of guys who have. Uh, yes. Yes. Who like this with this guy because he's a good guy.
sun is showing itself, its face from behind the, the clouds. It is quite a cloudy. Yeah. And yesterday we passed a Mont Montpellier. Right now we are uploading the video number 76 and we were lucky to again found, find a working electrical outlet. We slept here under the roof. We passed the Montpellier quite easily because there are many 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 roads around it so we did not have to use any road which goes to the center and a day before we passed the Arles city which hands down won the worst city street reward forever the road through the Arles city was so bad that I thought, uh oh, something is gonna give up, trailer is gonna get broken, me will get broken, my back will broke, something, anything will broke, it was so bad a road. Yep, my fear got realized, the nasty Frenchman shut down the electricity, so we are doomed. No sun, no electricity. Let's see what the day brings. We are in Périac de Mer and we slept uh, here under the roof. And <laughs> you don't have to guess, I will tell you. The con battery is completely dead. There is no electricity. Uh, behind is a uh, caravan parking and lucky us we have a toilet and a water there we came from there and we are at the co on the coast and as you can see it's cloudy and the weather report says it's going to be cloudy for a week and also cold we might have a glimpse of the sun now and then and I think the best thing is to wait <coughs> for the sun. There are the caravans park and we need to go that way. There is a city, but we'll wait here. And my thought was today is the anniversary, the first month of our travel. My wish actually was to reach the Spain but I don't think we will manage although we are very close All right, we met another traveler, and this is... This is Raul. Raul. Hi, Raul. I grew up in Spain on the Canary Islands. Yes. And I'm living in Switzerland now. So I thought, why not also um, go by bike all the way and yes. see, see, see how... He travel on his bike, but now he is stationed at a family. Yeah, uh, I have the big luck to know people here in Beriac, in South France. So I, I really needed a rest after many, many days of riding. Me too! <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah, but it's going, it's going on, traveling, yeah, for sure. To yeah. South Spain and from there I take the boat to Canarias, to Lanzarote. So very similar to me. 